All right. So here's the 2021 stump jumper alloy uh, that we're using. And uh, we're gonna cut some trails. First of all, this is an old deer trail here. We're gonna try to get it to where we can uh, head on and have a nice little trail to walk or a trail to ride. We're gonna make the mountain bike trail. So here we go. We gotta cut some things out. These are dead, but still you wanna get the, the stumps out. All right, as much as possible. You can leave a couple little things. But here you go, going right here, following through. And if I didn't remind, remember to tell you all that, or if I don't know if I told you this before, uh, this is the Corona razor tooth saw. You can pick it up at your hardware store. It is great. So this helps you uh, cut through. It's the next best thing to a chainsaw. Just let you know. Uh. All right. Uh. Clear some trail. Uh. Here we go. All right. We're good here. Let's get going on this. Okay. So I got to clear, clear some uh, brush out on this deer trail. A couple old pine uh, trees falling. Not my first rodeo, people. One thing you have to worry about is some of these, uh, some of these trees here, they have uh, spikes on them. Some of them have spikes. I we'll have a little tunnel here to go through. Gotta make it fun as you're riding through. This one I'm gonna 86 that. Just a second. I can keep the deer trail going. Coming up to a ridge here. So you see how we get this going. See how we're going in here. way 
back this way. It looks a little easier line because you want the best lines. Looks like this will work well. All right. Something going around this tree. Here we go. All right. Whoa. You see, you can get lost easy in the woods. Following one of these old deer trail. It's the way to do it though. Way to make the mountain bike trails. All right, I'm ready to ride a little bit. You can come down to this point. Make sure we're cleared back to my bike. Another little tunnel. A lot of vines and stuff you get rid of. Ah. Hey, these roots like this, you gotta watch out for those on the bike. Make sure you see them. You're coming in fast through here. Probably should take it out, but I'm um, leave it right now. So something to be aware when you're that's part of part of the challenge in riding these bikes. Find the best line. Find the best line, people. You gotta find the best line. And the best line here, I'm going to get rid of this line. There you go. Come from here. And we're, and hey, we're making music. put this here to let us know where the trail is our little tunnel here oh I gotta, gotta get rid of this number start with this one all right this I'm gonna pull across so what you got to do is start See how these work? It's really awesome. All right, looks good there. Really what you got to worry about when you're cutting is something to think about, these vines. They hold you back.
There you go. Alrighty. Clear the track. Right, we're just clearing this path that we just came out of that area. And down here, down here we have a, a creek bottom. I call it squirrel bottom. Anyway, just clearing a path down to here. There we go. See how this razor saw cuts? It's phenomenal. So, you see that, guys? I can clear, clear the trails. All right, down here we have a creek here. We can run a line down the creek. One thing about uh, some of these creek bottoms, they're opened up. Um, they're opened up down here. You feel it's pretty hard. This is actually a, a runoff area where it runs down and you have a little line we can probably get a line going over here if we're firm enough. Cross. See how firm we are. Yeah, pretty firm. So come around here. Let me get some of this holly, little holly bush tree. what kind of line we want to make here you want your best lines remember to cut these pretty close to the ground and you're cutting them on the ground like that there that way it keeps your keeps it going well Up and around here. Again, remember, remember, guys. You want to always uh, make sure you have uh, permission. I'm with MDA Timber. All right. Got some lines over here. Look 
Looking good. And you can make yourself a little, with the wood you have on the ground, make a little path so you can see it. When you first start out, when after you ride a little while, we can either go over there and jump it. I think we're gonna go around this one right here. Might make another one later. Remember these are, are good to hold the these uh, vines like that. Good to hold the dirt. Don't wanna lose too many of those. Unless they're right in your path, you can go around them. There's a nice little turn. Uh, but nothing's better to make Stumpy happy. You give it a nice trail, some nice lines around. It's going to be a nice little turn here. Old tree is here. And roots and down. You're gonna have to lose that one right there. to lose this this one here little holly holly bush So when you're making these lines, make sure they're clean, they're straight. You just want to make the best lines. You want to make the best lines you can here. And subscribe, best line mountain bike. MTB, best lines MTB. I think I can make that down there. It looks like a open enough. Let's go back and see how this rides. 